Ghana is faced with a lot of challenges. I've seen rapid erosions of our coastline. I've seen major bush fires around the island, things that I did not witness growing up. We will not allow that to happen now. We will be equipped with the knowledge this young generation has acquired to collect as much evidence as we can, both in GIS mapping and in filming, to pursue a court case if needed be. Indigenous culture and tradition are not written; they are orally spoken. There are a lot of legends which we don't document. With the chance that I have now, and with the skills which I have learned in the workshop, I would like to go back and uh, implement what I have learned, which I will document our sacred sites. People's Fire Project started with the belief to transfer the fundamentals of filmmaking and geospatial mapping to communities who are at the front line of deforestation and protecting their uh, forest territories and land with the idea that communities are best placed to tell their stories from their own perspective through their own lenses without any outside interference. Filming and geospatial mapping are so much more powerful when they are combined together. Communities can fly a drone and can document evidence of land change in a visual way and through spatial layers and geospatial mapping, they are able to back all that evidence with scientific data on how the land is changing over time and what kind of environmental damage is happening within their territories. The major industries that are not only threaten our environment, but the fabrics of our togetherness, of our clan system, has been the SABL, and that has turned into logging and the proposed mining of Lubungai further continues to, to divide our people, divide our clan, and a fight started that over the years uh, developed into a civil war. After hearing about the destructions in our communities, after hearing about looting, about raping, about burning down of households and of innocent households, about the displacement of our mothers and living in makeshift houses in, in the mangrove swamps, witnessing the schools closed down, hospitals closing down and with no medicine. I embarked in 2019, in June, with my children to go home and try to talk to our people, try to visit all the command house, and all the soldiers in the outpost to see if I could compromise with them to lay down their arms and to work with me to take out the fear that I saw in our mother's eyes, to take out the tears and to try to start laying down the foundations to restore peace and harmony on our island.
most of the youths that I know have been in opposite armies fighting against each other. I'm happy that from different challenges, from when they fought, that they are able to, to be together, to sit down together, to learn together, makes me happy and is putting the strength for me to go ahead. During the workshop, uh, I learned a lot with uh, camera techniques, using the drone, audio and lighting. I would say it's a, an opportunity given on a golden plate. I'm looking forward to execute uh, what I have learned back to my people. I would like to thank People's Planet Project for this opportunity. I found this opportunity very important to me, uh, especially when it comes to um, involving in community project and all that and John has a big vision for Lovangai and I would really love to be part of his vision for Lovangai and the people. I believe that I've acquired the skills and the knowledge to use the ARC GIS mapping software. At the end of the GeoStory camp, we leave the equipment with the community for the most effective documentation to be prepared when any logging company enters their territory. We will be there when the boats are, are on shore. We will be there to start documenting them, both in GIS mapping and in filming and monitoring logging from its start right to the end. Our only problem now is to find a good lawyer to fight for us in the court of law. If we are not going to do this now and then, Lovonga is going to lose it. We will be just another island without no roots. <laughs>